Hi everyone, to the bone, this is Darcy. And today I'm gonna share three amazing, life-changing hair hacks. These are easy, three hacks that would change your hair game, especially if you're a busy person. So if you wanna hear more about it, keep on watching. But before we get to this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like and share this video. Now, let's get to it. First hack is blow dry your dry shampoo. I know it sounds kind of crazy, but it works and makes your hair looks amazing. I wash my hair often one time a week because it takes a lot of time. And if you are a busy person, you can relate, especially if you have long hair. A lot of times the dry shampoo can get really white and you can totally just juju a little bit, but it, you can get some white spots. Blow drying it changes the game, guys. And I'm gonna show you how to do it. Apply the dry shampoo on your roots and then use your favorite blow dryer with a round brush. Normally, focus on the roots. I'm using my T3 blow dryer, which is a blow dryer and a brush at the same time. But truthfully, you don't need a fancy hair tool to get this hack done. You can use your regular blow dryer with your round brush and you get amazing results. Just focus on your roots and lift it up and take the excess of the dry shampoo out and style your hair and will smell delicious and look like you just wash it in style and you're good to go. Hack number two, do a hair mask before you work out. If you're a busy person, you don't have time to wash your hair as often and you have even less time to do a hair treatment. And being somebody with long hair and I also highlight my hair, I need hair treatments once in a while. So I've been doing this and it has been working out great for me. Put a hair mask before you work out. This tip helps because you can get a hair treatment while you're doing your workout, so you're multitasking. But also, if you have color hair or dry hair, when you sweat, there's salt on your sweat that can actually make your hair even drier. You can use for this hack any of your favorite hair masks. Just make sure it's not too thick or don't put too much of it, but make sure you put it all over your hair, use a hair tie, work out, come home and wash your hair and you'll see that will improve results from any of your favorite hair masks and will save you time in the shower. You can use any of your favorite hair masks to do this tip, but I have one that has worked out really well for me because it's not super sticky, it's not super drippy, and it kind of almost, the hair almost soaked it up like a serum, is the Hair La Vie Moisturize, Strengthen, and Revive Mask. This was sent to me complimentary by Hair La Vie, and this is actually my second tube. If I find my first tube, I will include it on the video. It contains amazing ingredients. I love it so much and has been working really well for this hack because it has a very interesting texture. It's almost like a serum. So I'm gonna apply a little bit of my hair so you guys can see here. So when I apply on my hair, it almost soak it up. Do you see? It doesn't even look greasy, but it is a hair mask. You can also use this hair mask in the shower after you wash your hair, shampoo, put it in the shower, leave at least five minutes. But my favorite way to use this mask is before I work out. So I put it on my hair, and as you guys can see, you can hardly even tell. The hair just soaks it up. I put it all over, and then I use this hair tie, which I have talked about in my channel before. I put this hair mask on at least once a week when I do get a chance to wash my hair. One of the things that I love about this mask the most, besides the results, is the scent. It smells so good. I like having the scent throughout the week because it really lingers on your hair, and once you put it on, you will not be able to stop smelling your hair. I love this mask for the scent, one of my favorite things, and also for the ingredients because it has really helped my hair become soft and smooth and less frizzy. So it really helps with shine, it helps with the hair health, with frizziness, and even hair thickness. By the way, guys, I have amazing hair masks that you can make it at home or some of my favorite ones that I have reviewed on my channel. And I'll leave that playlist on the description box below if you want even more hair treatments. And the third and final hack is to use a t-shirt, a raggedy cotton t-shirt to dry your hair. Using a cotton t-shirt will help you dry your hair quicker will help prevent frizziness and is actually a lot gentler on the hair strands. Because when your hair is wet, it's a lot easier for breakage, especially if you are very rough with a towel. So using an old raggedy cotton t-shirt on your hair will save you time and will also be a lot more healthy for your hair. So a lot of times when I don't have time to blow dry my hair, I use a cotton t-shirt and I let my hair air dry and it's so helpful because it helps to control the frizziness. It dries my hair quicker, but it's also a great hack to combine with hair tools because if you take most of the water out of your hair, it's a lot quicker to style, it's a lot healthier for your hair because you're not putting so much heat heating damage on your hair. So it's also a great hack to combine 
with hair tools to save you time. But if you want to get fancier, <laughs> you can also get this specific aqueous towel that is a special material that also helps to dry your hair quicker and controls freeziness and is an amazing towel. I actually have talked about this towel on previous videos before. Uh, I started using this aqueous towel when I was pregnant and then after I had my baby I kept buying multiple of them. As you can see they're in the background there. I have seven total because I love them so much. They're very, very great for babies uh, as a baby towel because they're very soft and gentle and dry really quickly. Now that my son is a toddler, I also use this aqueous towel to dry his hair because he's very fussy about drying his hair, so it dries really quickly. It's also a great towel to take it to the gym because it is very lightweight and also absorbs the water, the sweat, really well so it's a really good towel to take to the gym as well and that's why I have so many of them because I use them multiple ways. It's a little bit overpriced but I use it in so many different ways that for me is worth the purchase but for this hack you do not need a fancy towel you can just use your regular old raggedy t-shirt and you still get amazing results. If this was helpful make sure to thumbs up and share with someone. Thank you so much for watching I love you all so much I hope you're healthy and safe and I'll see you next time. Bye.